Okay, so I know that I was a little bit exaggerating when it comes to the thumbnail and the title, but nevertheless, I do want to protect myself when it comes to winter riding. And before I start the video, I just want to give you a little update, a little uh, channel update. I haven't been posting any riding videos lately and, and I know I apologize. The thing is that I'm getting a new bike. Uh, it's actually an e-bike. I've been searching around and I finally chose the one that I want. And I don't want to tell you <laughs> which one I chose. I'm gonna do a big review and but I can tell you that I can give you a hint. You see the shirt that I have in the back? I, I designed that shirt based on the bike so the color combination is gonna be red and blue and I'm so excited to show you guys uh, the e-bike that I got for this channel. All right so we can go ahead and, and jump into the video so these are the gloves that I got. Let's go ahead and unbox this or unbag it. <laughs> these are from Fox so what we got here is the Ranger gel and the reason why I got this is because they're not that expensive when it comes to buying things for riding anything it gets really expensive uh, but I wanted to update the gloves that I had before which is for for the summer or, or when there's like mild weather but I'm planning on doing some winter riding and I want to make sure uh, that I'm gonna be covered so I needed to change the gloves that I have to something like this something that's gonna be a little bit more padding there, there's not a lot of padding on this and the reason is I don't want to be uncomfortable. Sometimes my hands sweat a lot. So I didn't want to go too crazy with the padding. I wanted to go, I wanted to have something that was going to be mild. So it was going to have some protection, some padding, but it's not, uh, it was not going to be too heavy. Again, this one from Fox. And the good thing about these ones is that you have the uh, rubber tips. Uh, I'm not sure if that's going to make a difference when it comes to <laughs> navigating your phone. Uh, I haven't found a glove that can manage to do that well uh, but at least it's good that you have it there let me actually let me go ahead and let me put them on hold up wow I don't have my knife so I'm gonna have to improvise here and get some nail clippers <laughs> man this is so ghetto <laughs> <laughs> so these are supposed to dry really fast uh, when they get wet these are large I mean no no these are extra large I have some long fingers so I need to uh, when when I get large sometimes uh, they don't feel that comfortable Yeah, so these are the right size and it goes I like it that it goes all the way up and it doesn't have uh, the velcro that some gloves they put some velcro that's something that I don't like because uh, it gets messy and sometimes it's kind of loose I like this style uh, better let me try the other one Yeah, they, they, they feel really nice and comfortable. Like I said before, they don't, they're not that heavy. They don't have like a lot of padding, but it's, I think it's just enough. I mean, even though you're gonna be doing some winter uh, riding, you're not gonna go out on a storm. So, I mean, you're gonna, you're probably gonna, I'm probably gonna pick a day that is not that cold. Uh, I'm not gonna pick the one that is like below zero. But yeah, but I'm planning to do that. I, I never done that before. This is something that I'm gonna try with a new bike. I've been designing new jerseys for Frantic. 
So like I said before, you can see that there in the back, you can see the one that I'm gonna be using for the new bike. This is gonna be really fun. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a lot of videos um, talking about the unboxing, talking about the features, talking about the bike, how it handles. And I don't wanna give out too much <laughs> because I want it to be a big surprise. Uh, so that's it for the video. Uh, these are the gloves that I'm gonna be using for winter riding. I'll probably give make another video because this is just the unboxing. I'll probably test them out and see if they're good or now if I need to buy something else. I'm probably gonna maybe buy some some weatherproof pants and, and maybe a jacket or something. I have to I have to see because I, I want to be able to ride my bike and not be uh, affected by the weather. All right, so I guess I see you guys on the next one. All right, see ya. I'll be back.